Hey, my loves, welcome back to our channel. Thank you so much for joining me again. If you have not already, bust down while we go through this hot glue how to, okay? I hope you all guys are ready for this one. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back. We are here with some kitchen beautician stuff with Julia Hair. JuliaHair.com is a virgin hair supplier. Okay, they carry all types of hairs, bundle packages, and wigs. And this is a Brazil, we're doing a Brazilian start to finish bone straight hair wig on our own. Okay, so this will be a step by step. You guys will see exactly how I do it. I have real, I, my hands cramp up a lot because I type a lot. So what we're going to do, we're going to do something a little bit different. We're going to do a hot glue gun. So this will get you a wig. We're going to dye this wig and get her together in hopefully about two hours because we got to get up out of here, okay? So this came with three bundles, all right? We have the Brazilian Bone Straight, three bundles. We have her in 18, 20, and 22 inches. Okay, and we're gonna dye these jet black as well. And we're just gonna dye her jet black because sometimes I get a little washed out um, if I don't. You see what I mean? Like I need a little, I mean, maybe, yeah, we're gonna dye it. <laughs> this particular bundle package with the Julia hair, three bundles with the 13 by four is going for $238.92. Julia hair straight bundles are so nice to the touch and I'm just so surprised how little I have to do to the frontal. I take the T pins and I pin down my frontal. I'm just gonna braid her down just to make it easier for us to sew it to the dome cap. Okay, so now that our frontal is braided down so we can use a little comb you wanna come and T-pin her in, okay? And this will just help us when we're sewing down our lace. And then you can see the front, this is the front. See the hairline? We're just a little bit past, just a teeny, the hairline is a teeny, weeny bit past the dome cap, okay? And I'm just gonna come over here and make sure this is straightened out as well. Okay. Cause you want to make sure it's secure as you're sewing it down your frontal is probably the most important part of your wig so probably your frontal is the most important part of your wig okay that looks perfect to me now, I'm just putting a two in just to secure her down. So, when we sew her down, look at that parting space, guys. And this is what a black cap underneath. That's what your part looks like, okay? So, wait till we cut off this dome cap. This is going to look fantastic. So, I already have my needle threaded. Okay. So, we're just going to sew the julia hair 13 by 4 bone straight lace frontal down to our dome cap so this is super important and a reason why i start from a little bit above the corner is because it's easier to make sure that the dome cap lays flat when you start above the end and then there's no shifting or anything throughout and your t-pins will have it taut on both sides. So it'll be super tight and lay flat for you. So once your frontal has been all the way tacked down to your dome cap, we're gonna get into how to glue our tracks to this dome cap so i like to measure the length of the track we're going to start by pressing the t-pin into one side take our glue gun and just start pressing it down as we go glue a little and press down as you go then you go back take your t-pin out and then press that side down as well don't worry about getting those little residual white spots those little white strings you can always pull them out they come out super easy so again use your t-pin put your t-pin in on one corner take your glue gun and go across in a u form and press down as you go this is such an easy thing to do i made this unit in two hours not even and primarily a large part of that was 
me sewing it down because my nails and my hands are just uncooperative. So this is our finished product using our Julia hair and the 18 20 22 inch bundles with the 20 inch frontal and I must say I am obsessed okay so we're just going to get into the wig because she is done child we took a hot glue gun and went at it we're just going to chop the lace off while it's on the mannequin only because that's a personal preference of mine I have an aversion to scissors near my face. I don't know what it is. No judgment, but we're going to get her right together. This 13 by 4 frontal has baby hairs in the front with a pre-plucked hairline. And you can absolutely positively tell. She is so seamless and I am obsessed. I encourage everyone to check out Julia Hair for this bundle deal because it is everything. All right, guys, so we are back. We have our hot glue gun hair all on our head right now. And I am obsessed. I don't know about you guys. This took me all together to make about two hours, okay? So if you're looking for a super easy, I got some bundles and I want to throw her on type thing, this is exactly what you need to do. I, again, have this hair in 18, 20, and 22 inches with a 20-inch frontal. We sewed the 20-inch frontal down and glued the rest of that stuff all the way down she's super tight okay i love the way she feels i feel like the density right now is super thick she's probably more on the 150 side because i use just about all three of the bundles except for just a little bit of hair so i'm obsessed with julia hair it flat irons so well takes heat so well i dyed her fried her dyed her and laid her to the side and she has been living ever since so all right, guys, so if you have not already, bust down, subscribe to our channel, check out Julia Hair and their hair sale. They came through for tax season, honey. So for all my girls who was waiting on Uncle Sam to pay her back, pay him back, pay them back, Julia Hair got a solution for you and your hair needs. So I hope to see you guys later. I hope you enjoyed this video. Get into this how-to and I'll talk to you guys.